Which of your holdings is in an economically sensitive sector? Typically, uh, when people are fearful about, of recessions, uh, banks usually don't do well. Um, and reasons being uh, lower rates lead to lower income for banks, uh, all else equal. And second, people are worried about them recovering their loans. Uh, what if somebody defaulted and banks have losses? And in that respect, what the market has done now is uh, they painted almost every bank with the same brush. Uh, as a result, uh, one of our holdings, uh, Bank of Ozark, uh, now they're called Bank OZK. So Bank of Ozark uh, is painted with the same brush. They are trading really uh, at nonsensical valuations today. Uh, what we like about the bank is that uh, they are one of the premier banks in the construction lending sector. So their loan duration is really short, compar comparatively shorter than the other banks. And second, uh, they are one of the better underwriters uh, than uh, when compared to all the other banks in the US. And uh, what I mean by that, on an average, uh, Bank of Ozark has had loan losses uh, compared to other banks which are to the tune of 60% lower. So uh, their balance sheet is very uh, sane right now and uh, we believe in a recessionary environment they'll withstand much better than the other banks. How would Bank OZK perform in a recession? We expect bank to perform much better because of how they underwrite their loans and their balance sheet strength. Morgan Stanley actually did some interesting work around testing uh, banks' balance sheet, various banks' balance sheet in a recessionary scenario. So they emulated uh, 2001 and 2002 scenario as well as the financial meltdown in 2009 and 10. And what they found out is that Ozark, uh, in those kind of environments, their balance sheet would do much better than their peers. So we expect that to continue and um, we would expect that Ozark would be able to take advantage of that environment um, and be emerge as a better business.